Our vision for the district started with a single building, the Rolex building being built in what used to be called Little Mexico. The vision was one to create a downtown that was safe, that had green parks and trees. So we started by uh, planting a lot of trees around the Rolex building. Ultimately, every building coming into the district is dropped into our 18 city blocks of green parks and with office tenants enjoying uh, the greenery and an easier lifestyle, work style than what was here before. The Legacy Project, started by my father, who learned from his father, who was a developer in Switzerland. The Harwood District is an 18 city block master plan in Uptown, to the land between American Airlines Center, Ritz-Carlton Hotel, all the way up to the Kitty Trail. So we've got a great swath of land to play with, almost like a blank slate. We've only built a fourth of what we can build and will build in the next 10, 20, 30 years. We partner with uh, world-class architects who partner with our in-house architectural firm, HDF. A lot of creativity, a lot of energy behind what makes this company. Today it's really a city within a city and we're trying to develop Dallas's first and largest uh, living uh, urban community. You can live down the street from your office, there's a number of restaurants, bars, cafes, outdoor venues, close proximity from uptown, downtown, the Arts District, and the American Airlines Center. So it's really kind of at the confluence of, uh, of a number of really exciting places. I think that as Dallas continues to change, to be able to create something new during that exciting period, it kind of plays on all of these different attitudes and cultures. It's really exciting. This whole process of building what is today a fairly nice sized company started one transaction at a time, one idea at a time, and a little bit like my art collection, which is my passion, the samurai collection, which is very much part of what Harwood is about. Uh, we're trying to mix in, in addition to the office building, the uh, apartment for sale buildings, the gardens and parks and the restaurants, we have added to that a component which is art. Basically, we try and populate all of our buildings with some sort of art aspect in the lobby so that everybody, whether you're a tenant or visiting an office, as soon as you walk into the lobby, you see art everywhere you go throughout the Harwood District. The environment here promotes growth and learning. So you might start on the finance side and see yourself developing a building. And we do make it very easy for everybody to learn a little bit about everything so that you, are, you have a completely integrated team member. I've worked for this company for 16 years, so I'm a little biased. But I don't believe there's probably another company in Dallas who will let anybody with talent go as far as that talent will take them. And it doesn't even have to be in the position they started. We consider this truly a Harvard family. Not only the fa my family that I work with, but we take that all the way down. So we, uh, we truly try to grow within, train and educate from within so that they can grow with us. We've developed a, a culture here over the past few years of collaboration and uh, mutual respect. The fact that we're very vertically integrated allows for that kind of horizontal movement throughout the company. And it's not necessarily where we think you might be the best fit, but where that one person might be more interested, they're generally gonna work harder and better. So uh, we like to nurture that spirit and, and try to grow it. So about three years ago, I started as a bartender here at one of our restaurants called St. Anne. I was there for about a year, I became a manager, and three months into management, the CEO of our company came down and I guess he was impressed with how I was you know, running one of the shifts. It was an extremely busy day. And because of that, he offered me a position at the corporate office as a project coordinator to kind of help keep the projects moving, um, keep everyone on track, meet their deadlines. It's easy to grow quickly here if you do your job right, if you are dedicated. I mean, yeah, you can, there's a endless potential here. I like people who are curious. I like people who uh, want more, who want to be part of something bigger than them, who want to be proud to bring and uh, make, make a difference. 
You're never going to work on the same thing day in and day out. You don't get pigeonholed. There's every opportunity available to us. It's a great place, great people. They make you feel like they're all family. Everybody knows everybody and everybody focuses on each other's care throughout the company. So Dallas is our headquarters where we have our executive teams, but we have a, a growing office and projects in London. We have an office in Zurich. We also have an office in Beverly Hills. Uh, we've recently signed some new joint ventures and partnerships with some groups in Asia. So we're absolutely looking to grow outside of our district. Part of our growth, part of our success is the wanting to make a difference and to change things, change the way we serve, change the way we build, continuously challenging ourselves. We're trying to stay down to earth, family-owned business, and a respectful of everyone, customers and associates, and never forgetting where we come from.